right, we're going to use conjugates to get this guy into the right shape, which is some number plus some other number i. And fancy math terms, a plus bi. So we want this to look like this, because this is not really in its acceptable form. He needs to put some clothes on. I can't change the value, so I need to multiply by 1, because multiplying by 1 and adding 0 are the only two things I can do without actually changing the value. But I can multiply by a fancy 1. I can multiply by i plus 3 over i plus 3. This is the conjugate of the bottom. The top and the bottom here are both the conjugates of the bottom. So, now I have to do the arithmetic. i squared plus 3i, and then the bottom piece, which is i plus 3. And remember, when I do this, I'm adding in between each one. And then I have to do the same thing to the bottom. I'm going to try not to draw the arrows, although I will be doing it with my fingers. i squared plus 3i, oop, oop, and then minus 3i plus 9. Now you can use the super shortcut if you memorize it. I try not to clutter my brain with anything that I don't have to clutter my brain with. So i squared is negative 1. So this is both of these are negative 1. And I'm adding so they don't just poof disappear. And these two pieces cancel each other. Thing is designed to have that. And these two bits can go together. So I have negative 1 plus 4i, combining these, plus 3 over, and this is 8 on the bottom. So simplifying a little bit more, I have 4i, oh man, wouldn't that be nice if that went to 4? It doesn't. Plus 2 over 8. And I'm still in the wrong order. I need 2 plus 4i over 8. And then 8 needs to go underneath each. So 2 over 8 plus 4 over 8i. And because I'm a whiz-bang with fractions, watch me screw this up, I have 1 fourth plus 1 half i. And it's not entirely pretty, but it is this shape. We've got a number plus a number, an i. A number plus a number. Here's a number, 